should not even know that organisms, microorganisms existed and caused disease. We used to think it was just something that happened to you, just random things. We didn't link that microorganisms cause disease. Things don't just arise from nothing. For a long time they had, of course, manual tests and things like that, so we get better results quicker nowadays. You can learn 90% of everything you need to know with a couple 10, 20 minute tests. 20, 30, 40 years ago, it'd take an hour or two to get anything done on any one patient. We know so much more about the immune system just in the past couple of years, and every year we know more and more and more, so things are constantly changing in this field. There's constantly new techniques. Not sure that most people even know that lab techs is a position that exists. I think you kind of know that it exists in some capacity, but I don't think most people realize exactly what it is or what it is that we do. Most people have probably had their blood drawn at least once in their life, but they don't always understand where that blood goes. And so that blood generally comes down to the lab. And there's so many different tests that we can do on that blood, anywhere from cholesterol and triglycerides to helping diagnose diabetes, to then looking at potentially infectious organisms, okay, or viruses. There's a lot more to it that people don't realize. So those people that are really interested in science, they don't necessarily want to work at the front end of healthcare and maybe have patient contact, but they still want to be involved in helping the community and helping people become more healthy.